Hey everyone. Um, I just thought I'd tell you about my day. It was pretty difficult, honestly. Um, my students and I, we, I don't know, we just kind of went back and forth. Uh, many of my students have expressed a want to really focus and learn English, but they get distracted. Um, this is what they say. They get distracted by the other students in the class because, you know, they're kids. They want to goof off. They don't want to listen. Um, they just don't care. And um, I've just really been trying to focus on curriculum and I'm um, getting things done so my students can learn um, if that's what they want to do and uh, so today I had to be the bad guy a lot um, a lot a lot I had to take things away I had to um, send people out into the hallway I had to just be the bad guy and I'm just not good at that but, uh, I don't know, at one point I was writing vocabulary on the board and um, this kid, he threw this like stick that um, we used to lock one of the windows and, uh, and I turn around and it was at my feet and I had taken it away so many times and I got so frustrated that I just dropped my piece of chalk and I walked out I walked out of the room just like that um, I was gone for about four minutes came back um, everyone was quiet which is very rare very rare and um no, they said, Missy, Missy, you okay? And I just kind of ignored them. And um, I finished the vocab. And then I told them, you know, just get with your partners and talk about this. Um, like, they knew. I just, I didn't care what they did. Um, and I sat down at my desk and I was just so discouraged. And um, they were quiet and... You know, they were actually doing what I asked them to do, which never happens. And um, I sit down at my desk, and my Facebook is pulled up, and I see that my baby brother is online. And I messaged him that I really miss you. He messaged me about how much he missed me. And I just started bawling in front of my class, just bawling and as soon as the tears started rolling down my face um, my two troublesome kids um, really they they like jumped out of their seats and um, their names are Jeff and Jerry they jumped out of their seats and one of the seats actually like fell backwards because they were in such a hurry and they were tripping over themselves to get to me and like they both ran up to my desk and they handed me um, these packs of Kleenexes that they carry around and they said Missy Missy I'm so sorry I'm so sorry please don't cry don't be sad Missy and they just they were just really encouraging me and um, the rest of the time the class was perfect absolutely perfect they did what I asked them to do they um, talked like they they spoke up in class when I needed them to they participated when I needed them to and um, it was just really wonderful like I know I know my class loves me. I do. I love them. Uh, since the very first day, uh, every time I leave my desk, 
um, I'll come back to find presence at my desk and um, this is presence like these um these I have them on me one second These birds, these origami birds, um, a lot of times, every time I leave my desk, I'll find something like this uh, sitting there when I come back. And today, my students brought me candy from lunch. Um, just all this candy and all these presents and these notes telling me that they love me and I am a good teacher and that I'm really nice and I'm beautiful and it was just really heartwarming. My students are a handful but I'm really glad that I have them. I really am. Ah. Well, I have you here. Please pray for this kid in um, Cassie's class. He's getting bullied really badly, like really badly, and uh, just pray that he he learns from it, that he learns that he's stronger than he thinks he is, and that. And pray for Kathy. She's having a really hard time with it too because there's really nothing that she can do. But I have a couple videos for you uh, from a carnival we had yesterday. So I love you. Continue praying for me, for all of us. Lord knows we need it. I love you.